Manuel González Martí was one of the most relevant characters of Valencian cultural life in the late 19th century and the greater part of the 20th century. His multifaceted personality, coupled with enormous intellectual curiosity and special artistic sensibility, brought him from a young age to successfully combine his facets as an artist, researcher and collector, aspects which without doubt marked his personal and professional future. An intense activity throughout his long life led him to surround himself with a wide circle of friends, full of great artists, writers, intellectuals and politicians of his time, with whom he shared the same curiosity. The Benjuri family, the Pinazo family, Blasco Ivanyev, Soraya, as an artist noted for his skills as a caricaturist, a facet which grew under the pseudonym Polchi. His interest in the graphic world led him to become editor of illustrated magazines such as Casa Carabias, which combined humor, literature and criticism of artists, and where there is no shortage of his own cartoons. He devoted many years to teaching and research, especially the world of ceramics, in which he became a dedicated specialist. To this we must add the high public offices he held throughout his life. Known facets, combined with one of his great passions, collecting, especially ceramics, and to a lesser extent, decorative arts. Since the year 1954, the date of the opening of the museum, González Martí himself was its director. He died in 1972, a period in which their resources were enriched considerably, which made this museum an essential reference for world specialists in ceramics both nationally and internationally. A passion shared equally by his wife Amelia Cunha, which led them to gather large and important collections, which, altruistically and selflessly, they decided to donate to the Spanish state, and which now form the core foundation of the current González Martí National Museum of Ceramics and Sumptuary Arts, located in the emblematic Palacio de Dos Aguas in Valencia.